What is PQQ? What do CoQ10, vitamin C, glutathione, and PQQ have in common? PQQ, or pyroloquinoline, we know, is a natural compound that already exists in our cells. There are high levels found in human breast milk. Foods commonly found in are leafy vegetables, fruits, legumes, and especially soy, or Japanese natto. This little-known cofactor nutrient is the stimulus behind the mitochondrial cell powerhouses antioxidant defenses against cellular level damage. It makes new cells, which is regenerative cell propagation. Cofactor means that this is a molecule that transfers electrons during reactions, which help the mitochondria produce energy. Other powerful cofactors that transfer electrons are glutathione, CoQ10, and vitamin C. PQQ is one of the best kept secrets in the nutritional supplement community and is receiving a lot of attention in the health and wellness spheres, and for good reason. The three primary functions it provides are antioxidant and anti-inflammatory actions, new mitochondrial growth, nerve cell support. What does this all mean? Protecting your cells from free radicals, which is a byproduct of inflammation. A large amount of diseases can be attributed to inflammation in body organs and cell tissues. New mitochondrial growth provides more energy in a cell and the better it does its job. More energy in your heart makes your heartbeat stronger, and more energy in your skin allows your skin to heal faster from wounds. PQQ is found to promote the growth of a small protein called NGF, or nerve growth factor, which plays a critical role in the growth development and maintenance of neurons. This increased level of NGF helps stimulate nerve regeneration, peripheral nerves, and maintains the overall health of the brain. It is important to note the majority of studies conducted involving PQQ were in animals. More studies involving humans are needed to better understand how it works in human bodies. Researchers find the studies very exciting and promising, especially since there are few to no side effects reported and lots of promising data. Supplements are commonly sold in 10 mg, 20 mg, and 40 mg capsules. For new users, maybe start with the lower dosage and monitor the effects, as getting the benefits from food is difficult, even from the PQQ-rich foods. Kidney damage was found only in very high doses in a toxicology study performed on rats, so make sure to check with your doctor and or pharmacist for proper intake levels and dosages. Thank you so much for watching today. We really appreciate your support. Please like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video.